I'm going to give, not now, but I'm going to give you two talks uh, in a series. Uh, the first talk will be on this uh, uh, cubics, uh, cubes, about this dice. And I'll tell you immediately why. You can imagine, you see here the theta, which you don't see what it means, this theta. You see here that E, theta, is complex. Now, we know from standard quantum mechanics that the eigenvalues of the Hamiltonian, since the Hamiltonian is a remission, they are real. We prove it. And now I'm saying it's complex, so how comes? And then the next talk will be on this cube. That is written that the inner product can give you that the wave function is orthogonal to itself. How it's happened? It cannot happen in standard quantum mechanics. In emission quantum mechanics, it may happen. It doesn't have to happen, but it may happen. And the question that I want uh, 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 to raise later is it a um, 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 result of our description of nature by non emission quantum mechanics? So it's result is a mathematical uh, complication, or there is a, something physics that stands behind this uh, this phenomena? And this. Uh, uh, what I want to show to you that there are physical phenomena that associate it with the possibility to have a state that is orthogonal to itself, whatever it means.